If you're an avid Twitter user or even watch YouTubers such as Such Speed, Notre Dan, or Six Striker, you would know exactly what this client is. Feather Client has just released into its beta stage, and I personally think it's the next big client. Everything I say in this video is genuine, and I was not forced to say. Smash the like button for eternal health and subscribe to get me to 2k subscribers. Alright, so first off, if you guys want to download this client, go to feathermc.com and it's right now only available from Windows, but just press this link and it should take you in. There you go, you've now downloaded FeatherMC. So basically, when you're done downloading, you can just open up Feather Launcher and it should open up this GUI thingy right here, I guess. It's similar to like Lunar Client and Badline Client. It's like where everything is. You could install mods and whatever. I already actually have a lot of it set up. You could do your settings here. But yeah, you could allocate your RAM, you could do your JVM ARGs and so on and so on so forth but yeah the main point of this video what separates this client from any other client is that you can have your own mod and it runs it through forge it's not like its own actual thing like lunar and badline there's limited to four versions and it's limited on mods but you could just choose whichever one you want so yeah if you want to add your own mods just go to browse mods so go here mods browse mods and then choose which mods you want just click on it make sure the mc version is compatible with the one that you want and then just add it go also toggle it right here and um yeah i like how they have it cut down into categories so say you want one dedicated to straight high pixel so you play a lot of sky block you just go 1.8.9 you add that and that's literally it that's all you have to do if you don't want it just remove it or you could just toggle it right there so yeah as you guys can see i already have some mods here i have chat triggers quick play um high stats i have a lot of mods set up already i already did my own thing try to experiment with this before i actually started this recording but yeah let's just hop into minecraft real quick all right guys so here we are feather client has just loaded up as you guys can see this is a pretty cool g well, I'm not gonna lie, it's already better than bad lines. No hate the bad line, by the way. I really still do love bad line. It's just that this GUI is so clean and it's actually on par with Lunar, I, I would say. So, yeah, right here, you could select your account. Say you have multiple accounts, you could select it. It has a nice preview for your account and the skin and whatever. You also have your feather mod. So, over here is all your mods. Same thing, similar with Lunar. You could customize it uh, right here, see which ones you want. You could also add profiles, uh, sort it like this. You could have your favorites, so on and so forth. And then, right here is your replay mod so i know a lot of you guys a lot of content creators would love this right here yeah it's replay mod for like say your gameplay or say you want like do your intro or outro here's your replay mod perfect for that uh there's cosmetics right here so it's again similar to lunar and badline you have your your capes wings boots i've never seen that before and hats i don't have any right now but you guys could buy your own on the website so yeah guys we are on high pixel now and as you guys could see with the fps counter on top and the potion status in the top left i'll be honest with you guys right now this is one of the smoothest well not one of the it is the smoothest client i i have right now this is actually better than lunar client in my opinion one thing i would say my fps fluctuates a lot more than it does on lunar or bad line but i mean i guess that comes with it but yeah if i go ahead and press right shift i actually changed it to a uh, tilde that's what i changed it to here is the gui here's your cosmetics once again you could check this out let me go back and here are your feather settings which i showed you guys earlier in the menu screen so yeah once again you could just configure these you could create your own profile i think yeah right here you can create your own profile if you want you clone and rename it do whatever you want right here say you're playing prisons you want one for a prison server just create a new profile name type in prison create profile and then just do whatever you want but yeah moving on to the left side here general general here you could change before this was previously red that's like the default one but i changed mine to purple of course purple is op you could change whatever you want put it on i suggest using borderless full screen this is again all up to you guys what you guys want to do but i personally use borderless full screen since it's a lot more better better to alt tab out of if you do that a lot ui quality uh, ultra because yeah once again these are just up to you and your preference but um yeah this is this is what i use and then moving on over here chat options once again this is up to your guys's preferences but it's pretty cool that this client has so many features that you could use and that you're able to change chat toggle chat you even press a make a button okay and one last thing the most important thing of a client is a performance tab so right here oh for so yeah right here is it, it's there's only a little bit of things but i mean i haven't changed much from it other than i turned lazy chunk loading off because before it was that medium i'm so uh, i changed it to off but to be honest even though i haven't changed it the performance that as i said the fps and how smooth this client is in general is just amazing the one thing i wish it had was motion blur but they're continuously adding stuff to the client so i hope to see that soon I'll have to give it up to Feather Client for proving me wrong and really showing me how good their client really is. If you guys didn't enjoy, please be sure to smash that like button. And as always, if you have not already, subscribe so we could get to 2k by the end of this month. Anyways, have a great rest of your day.